the reason why I don't have a pension, I will never opt into having a pension, I will never start a pension, is, well, basically, when I was at home to Haringey, when I was an apprentice, I was not in the pension scheme. And then when they increased my salary, when I got fully qualified, they automatically put me in a pension scheme. So I remember I got my wage slip and I saw like the deductions, NI, whatever deductions. And then I saw like, obviously you get London waiting. I'm sure you lot still get London waiting and that now. Obviously I moved out a couple of years ago, so I don't work in London. Anyway, I see some other deduction. What was this? So I took it to HR. I'm like, yo, what's this? They're like, oh, that's a pension. I said, I never opted into no pension. I wasn't in it before. They're like, yeah, once you become fully, fully qualified, you get opted into it straight away. I said, remove me from it today, now. Anyway, she said, okay, it will be removed on your next pay packet. Cool. So the reason why I won't ever subscribe or start join a pension, whatever you want to fucking call it, yeah, is because I've got a healthy brain and a healthy body. There's no excuse for me to not have enough money to the point where I need to depend on a pension and that. Whether it's private and or public. Like, if I don't become a millionaire or close to, then I'm a fucking idiot because you don't need to be that intelligent. Yeah? All you need to do is have an average brain and a healthy body and there's no excuse. So I must have done something wrong to not be in a position where I don't need a pension. So therefore, I deserve to suffer. You lot might think this is crazy, but this is, this is why yeah, I'm so judgmental and so harsh online and in the real world, obviously. But obviously, you lot don't know me, so you lot just see me online. Because I'm so harsh on myself, of course I have to be harsh on everyone else in the world. I'm not going to get up and do the things I don't want to do, stay disciplined, work every fucking day. I don't take any days off ever. I took I took a week, two, two weeks off work. They they thought there was something wrong with me. Yeah. I don't take days off work. I've been on this contract for three years. I've only taken off two weeks, and that's because I was I was sorting out something. Yeah, it's something after. So, so yeah, I took off two weeks off work. I don't take time off work. There's no way I'm going to be a disciplined, hardworking, hard grinding, hard sacrificing individual and be harsh on myself. But everyone else in the world can just get away with being lazy pieces of shit. No way. So that's why I'm so harsh and judgmental on everyone because I hold myself to a high standard than that. Some woman made a video. Um, Obviously, I used part of her video to talk about the point that I wanted to talk about. And what I was talking about was apparently Muslims are exempt from council tax because their house is a place of worship. Yeah. And in the beginning of that video, she was saying, I just want to put it out there. I believe that everybody is equal to me. And I was like, shut up. Shut up, man. You don't believe everyone is equal to you. Me personally, yeah. People are equal to me on like a human rights thing. Yeah, everyone deserves food, water, and shelter, and whatever. And that, yeah, I believe we all have equal rights in terms of human rights. But other than that, we're not equal. Ask yourself this question: If you truly believe you are, everyone is equal to you. When you see a crackhead, when you see a homeless person on the street, I'm not saying you look down on them, but do you see them as an equal? Can this person sit in a room and chat to you? Yeah, on the level, like. Do you see them as an equal? Because no one who's sleeping out on the streets is an equal to me. It's not that I look down on them. I will talk to me. I will have a conversation with a kraken. Yeah. What I'm saying is we're not equal. We're not equal. We're, we're, we're not on the same level. You start in your boxing career and you've just about punched up a punch bag. And you think you can, you can sit down in the same room as Mike Tyson and, and chat to him. You're not equal. I'm not e people are not equal to me in this world. There, there's people who, yeah, they're above man. Like you can't talk to me like I'm an idiot. You can't disrespect me. I'll move to you. But what I'm saying is, yeah, their level is higher than mine. We're not equal. You think you think my level is the same as you think I'm on the same level as Jeff Bezos or Elon Musk or or, Al or Alan Sugar or Donald Trump? No, no, they can't take me for an idiot. But we're not on the same level. 
We're not. So we're not equal. Yeah, we all deserve equal and human rights, but we're not equal. We're not equal. I'm not going to get up and do all the things I'm supposed to do. Work hard, make sacrifice, buy five properties, and then chat to a man that's the same age as me, that could have done the same things as me. Our timelines are all different. I'm not expecting just because you're 31, you're the same age as me, you're supposed to have five properties. No, because there's a 28 year old that's got 10. Yeah? Our timelines are all different, but you need to be making that effort. If you if you are not making the effort and you're not you're not moving forward in your life, we're not equal. I don't care if you're my friend from when I was 17. We're not equal. You, we're not equal. We can't, we're not even if they created clubs, yeah, we wouldn't even be in the same club. I can enter certain clubs that you can't enter. We're not equal. There is a hierarchy. I'll still speak to people with respect, but we're not equal. We're not on the same level. That's a disrespect to my hard work and my hard effort and my hard sacrifice and my hard grind. For me to do all of that, for then someone to do nothing, but we're on the same level. This is why I will never, I will never go to war. Never go to war. I will never go to war. Imagine me putting my life on the line for people in this country to wake up and say, I'm depressed, I'm sad. You know, I just don't feel like it today. I feel like it every day. Well, whether I feel like it today or tomorrow, it doesn't matter. It gets done. There's no way. There's no way. That's why I never fight in no war to help and protect nobody. I, I'm out for myself. I'm out for me and my mum and my little sister. Yeah? I'm, not, I'm not out for nobody else. Nobody else. Those are the people that I'm protecting me. So, yeah, we're not equal. We're not equal. There's man whose level's higher than mine. Yeah, there's man that's level's higher than mine. Yeah, I respect that. And there's people whose level's not as high as mine. And yeah, I don't respect that. I'm not gonna treat, I'm not gonna speak to anyone like they're an idiot. I don't even talk to children like they're idiots. No, I don't talk to people like they're an idiot. But we're not on the same level. I'll treat people with human respect, but we're not on the same level.